do this. Hello everyone! Hope you're doing super awesome. Welcome to Ravana and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I recommend that you do because you're going to be getting notifications of my new videos and it's free, so that's really cool. And remember that I, you can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, Tumblr, and all of my social networks where I'm uploading videos and pictures and everything about my lifestyle. One thing about raw vegans or vegans or if you, even if you're just trying to eat more fruits and vegetables is smoothies. Smoothies is a great way to eat more fruits and vegetables because A, it's really fast, B, they taste really good, and C, you're getting in a lot of nutrients and vitamins from different types of fruits and leafy greens or veggies. So I've made this video to show you my top five smoothies of all time. And it was a little bit difficult because I love smoothies and it's really fun when you start getting into the smoothie thing because you start like experimenting with new fruits and veggies and then it's like, whoa, I made this, like this is so cool. And then it's like my creation and it's really cool. Okay, so are you ready? Let's do this. <laughs> okay. My favorite, favorite, favorite of all time, and I know for a lot of you it won't be, but it's okay, it's just an idea. It's uh, papaya and pineapple. That's really, it's really simple, and it's, I really like it because it's very detoxifying, and I personally love papaya. It's one of my favorite, favorite fruits. And pineapple is super detoxifying too, and pineapple is great for all smoothies because it has like, like a, in between acid and like really sweet flavor. So, are you ready? I'm gonna try it. Mm. It's really, really good. You wanna make sure that the papaya is um, very ripe. One way, one way to know that the papaya is uh, very ripe is you're looking at it from the outside and you go like this, like you pinch it, and if it smells strong, then you know it's ready, okay? So that's my number one. Number two, uh, this is a green smoothie. This one is really, really one of my favorite ones and I have a video on it in my Spanish YouTube channel and it's called the Licuado Verde Quema Grasa and it's like burning fat. <laughs> it's really good. And I know a lot of people are not eating enough veggies. So this is a great way and it's really sweet. It's so, so, so delicious. So this one has pineapple again. It has a uh, banana, romaine lettuce, spinach, and celery. And I know that's a lot of greens, but believe me, like it's really, really sweet. Oh, mm. Wow, it's so good. <laughs> good. I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm so excited to be drinking all of these later. <laughs> okay, next one is another green smoothie. And this is really one of my favorite ones. This is one that I made at the beginning when I was first starting the lifestyle and I was living in Mexico City and mangoes were in season and I was just like, oh my God, I was so excited. So uh, this one has mango, orange. You can choose if you want to do orange juice or a whole orange. So this one has a uh, mango, uh, orange and spinach okay and remember that for all of these smoothies you you're gonna be adding water okay so for all of these smoothies you can either add water normal water or you can add coconut water and this is my personal favorite coconut water because it's it tastes like raw like from an actual coconut or you can use water from a fresh coconut okay and also you can add ice to all of your smoothies and it makes it kind of like a milkshake, milkshake kind of texture, which is really good. So this one, spinach, mango, orange. Okay, very simple. And you wanna keep your smoothies at a maximum of five ingredients. Anything more is a little bit too much for my taste. So let's see. Mmm, wow, it's so good. Like. <sighs> You just taste all the fruits and it's like, really? Like, so beautiful. And it's so fun, like I love eating this way because fruit is so good. Like, there's never a time where I'm not craving fruit. It's like juicy and it's ripe and it's fresh and it's 
sweet and it makes you feel good. Okay, next one is, this one is really, really good. I make this for my family all the time, especially my brother and my cousins because it's sweet and it, and I add kale to it and kale is, it's so high in minerals. It's really amazing for the body, for your energy, for your skin, for your vitality, for everything. It's just amazing. I love, love kale. So this one has banana, it has strawberry, blueberries, and I love blueberries, so good. Um, dates, and kale. So, let me try it. Mm. So good. So this one is like really like, it has like an acid taste to it, but it's sweet too because of the mango. So this one has mango, uh, kiwi, and remember that kiwis, you can eat them with the skin. I used to peel off the skin. It's really annoying to peel off the skin from a kiwi. So if it's organic, well for me, for myself, if it's organic, I'll leave the skin. So leave the skin, and this one has, okay, mango, kiwi, and strawberries. And remember that the strawberries you can also leave in the stem because it has nutrients. And uh, the green is romaine lettuce. And romaine lettuce is a great leaf to use in your smoothies because it doesn't have like a very strong taste and you're still adding minerals. So that's a great way. And remember, you can water, coconut water, and ice. So, let's see. Mm. Mmm, so good. This one is really fresh and perfect for summer days. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and don't forget, I really want to see all of your uh, recipes and favorite smoothies, so please put them on the comments below so we can all see them and try new things with different fruits and thank you so much for stopping by and watching. Remember to share this video with your friends, with your family, so we can all drink more delicious smoothies and feel better and eat healthier and I'll see you all next time, okay? Bye! <laughs>